What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Super Cooper Sunday. Coop, what were you trying to steal on the table there? He definitely wasn't taking a look at what we have up here on the table. Hmm, look at this. A Red Dead Redemption mug full of snacks. Can I interest you in some snacks too? Would you like to sample a dog snack? I doubt it. Yeah, that's gonna be a no from her. So guys, today we are gonna be testing what's going on in this big brain of his. He's He's got a lot going on up there, right? To to totally has it all together. He's actually, I, I feel like he's pretty smart. He, he acts dumb. He's smart, but he just, his body moves faster than his brain does. That's the problem. <laughs> this is a level two intermediate toy. This is another level two, but possibly a little bit harder. Looks a little bit tougher. And then this is a level three advanced toy, which they have never attempted before. So we are really pushing it to the limit today. In typical Super Cooper fashion, we are gonna be putting the boys head to head here. So Coda, I'm expecting the best out of you today. Don't pay attention to the cat that's upside down, scratching her cactus. She doesn't have much going on in her head either. You are one of the smartest dogs I have ever met. You are one of the craziest dogs I've ever met. You each have your own pros and cons, strengths and weaknesses, and we're gonna see who comes out on top. Here we go. So there's three toys, that means three rounds, and then we're going to do three minutes per toy. So however many compartments they can reveal in the three minutes each. <laughs> Each compartment will be one point. We're gonna start with this one, the tornado. It has a couple of these bones that stop it from moving. So before they can get to the second layer, he has to figure out how to remove this bone, and then there's three spinning layers. Three minutes on the clock. We've got our referee here, and uh, here we go. Good boy, all right, first one. one's down. For an intermediate one, this one's really so tough. It actually took me a second to figure out how to fill all the spaces. Cause you have to get it all lined up. Get it! He's already getting frustrated. This might be a low scoring game. I don't know how they expect him to think to remove the white piece. He's kind of getting a little tricky. I think he got one of the bottom compartments through the side. Not really the way you're supposed to do it, but hey, whatever works. He's just finding the weirdest little angles that he can get his tongue in there. He's not playing it the way he's supposed to and he's getting frustrated. You already got the trees out of that one, bud. You're gonna have to keep moving. I love how you can see him visibly getting frustrated. Oh, he's just gonna, he's just gonna oh. bite it. <laughs> All right, he's still working on it. That, oh, oh, the white one fell out. Good boy, good boy, get it. I'm gonna help you out, I'm gonna get it off the bed. Come on, come on, come on. You could potentially spin. You could spin the yellow part now. Spin the yellow one, the top one. Good boy. 10, nine, eight. Here we go, Coop, this is it. Come on, you gotta spin the yellow one. You gotta spin the yellow one. Oh, right there at the end. Seven. Seven, Seven points. That was a pretty good job. Respectable. Oh no, I have bad news. The white piece over in the bed is still, it's got one in there. We're gonna have to take a point away. He only got six. six. We're still proud of you, you can still, still take that one. Oh, Cooper. still didn't get it? It's on, it's on the ground now. Coda's first round, here we go. Same rules, three minutes, let's get it. Three, two, one, go. And the ref is back. He's off to a hot start. Two points already, that was quicker than Coop. And he's gonna get the third one here. Look at him go. I always love seeing just how different they are personality-wise. He hasn't even moved the base. Coop is crazy, picks it up, runs around, tries to brute force his way in, which works sometimes. Coda's a lot more reserved, a lot more cerebral. You can tell he really gets to thinking about it. Starting to get a little more pushing action. We're getting down towards the, the end of his run. I think he got a majority of the ones that aren't the bones. Mm -hmm. And he knows, like he sees the bone, he has to move it. He just can't figure out how to get it out. Five, four, three, two, one. That's it. Did it almost look like he got a little little concerned at the end yeah, with the I countdown? He was, really he, was, he was speeding up. Seven, eight. 
Nine. He got every single one except for the ones that had the bones over top. That's a good job. Pound it. Good boy. <laughs> Game number two is more complicated than it looks. So each one of these red things has a flap with treats in it, and then you have the bones. Which we already know are super hard. Yes, but the kicker is both of these flaps move. Slide over from both sides. So there's a big opportunity for points here. Yeah. You're just gonna have to get rid of the white bones. Hit it. Here we go. Starting off, just examining. I feel like the flaps probably won't be too hard, but we'll see. 15 seconds in, no luck so far. I mean, if you flip the board, that's gonna get you quite a few points too. That's true. This, I never, I didn't even think about that, but this might actually give Coop the benefit. <laughs> oh, oh, he had it open. Oh, he's got one open. Nice Good job, job buddy. buddy. Opened it with his paw. I was not expecting that. The problem is he keeps, oh, there it is. Good boy. Good boy. I was gonna say he keeps getting these white ones up, but then they keep resetting back in. Now he could potentially move one of these two over to the sides. If we're being honest, he's smarter than Cooper. Yeah. Oh. We, we would never tell Cooper well, he's that. Got but two and one. What? Good job, buddy. Got about a minute left here, Coda. You're doing a great job. He's sliding these things around all over the place. Good, wow. Good, good job. Good boy. He I'm keeps happy. sliding the same ones, thinking yeah. there's just gonna be magically more treats behind them. Well, like this one, he, didn't, he never opened that oh, one. Oh, get it, get it, buddy. Nicely done. And that's a oh, wrap. He got, he he got, got it. it right at the end, buzzer beater. All right, pick it up. Let's see what he got. Buddy? Eight. Nice job, buddy. That puts you at a total of 17. Coop, we need a huge round out of you right here. You currently have six points. Coda's got 17. We need 11 to get a tie. Do you think you're ready? I think this one might trend in your favor, but we'll see what happens. All right, here we go. Three minutes on the clock. Three, two, one, go. There it is. Starting off fast and aggressive. A lot of movement, not a lot of, not a lot of treats so far. Come on, buddy. He's getting frustrated. I feel like it took Coda a minute, but once he figured out what they all did, he did better. So, oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> we can't hurt him, right? We can't no, back. no, he's gonna have to flip it back himself. You got treats in the ground over here, buddy. If you don't get those treats, each each one is a half a point, I guess. You gotta you gotta eat the treats. I didn't even think about it. All the white ones fell out too. Yeah. So he's if he gets this thing flipped around, he's gonna have free reign. Now we're focused on the small white piece. I don't think there's anything underneath that. Oh, there was a piece. Nice job. Coop, you got you got 15 seconds. Just under 15 seconds. Coop, get it. Get it. Good boy. Get it. Go. Go, go. Oh, he's freaking himself out now. He's pushed it over into the, the front desk area. Okay. Uh, three, two, one. That's a wrap. How'd he do here? It looks like some of these slid when he flipped it over. Oh, he missed one there. Let's just get all the food pieces. So this would take him to 19, 18, 17, 16, 15. This one he only got half of, so that's gonna take him down to 14 points. I'm gonna be honest, if this were an official competition, I don't know if that strategy would have been available. He pretty much- You didn't do any of just the said, things. You just slid it until stuff fell out. He said screw the rules, but it, it works. I gotta be honest with you. I don't think he'll get more than maybe three points on this one, this if one even that. Nuts. You have this piece here, which this is locked in. You've gotta move that, there's a slot there, and then you can spin this around and there's treats in every slot. You've also got these, so you need to move this and spin this, and there's a slot there, and then you can move these around and these could potentially get stuck back in there and lock this again. It's just a very interesting, very difficult one. Coop, I'm just being honest. I, I think you need some points here, bud. And flipping it is not, it's not gonna work. So we're really gonna have to work hard here, okay? I don't think this three point lead's gonna hold. Here we go, three, two, one, go. Three minutes on the clock and we are off to the races. Ooh, he already kind of moved one of the tails. Nicely done. So that's one point. He's now currently up by four. I feel like he's gonna give up on this one. He's got the right idea. Judge is coming in to make sure all rules are being followed. Regulation. She approves. Going for this mermaid tail over here. Got another one. All right, he's, he's putting in work here. He's got the mermaid tails down. This is where it gets tough. Oh, he's on the right one. <gasps> Good, Good boy. Oh, and no. 
then he relocked it. <gasps> oh, good boy. That's another. I'm I'm blown away. No. I was not expecting this. I think Coda's gonna have to clear the board to to tie, yeah, right? To. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's where we're at. Good boy. Are you giving up? I'm not 100% sure, but I think one more is gonna solidify you the win if you can do it. Get it, Coop. Five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. Okay, here, you wanna see the, the, there you go. Coop, you got five points out of nine. That's gonna give you an eight point lead. Coda's gonna have to just about clear the board to tie, or if he clears the board, that's a victory. All right, buddy. I have so much faith in you here. I, do you think he's gonna do it, honestly? I think he can. He even licked, he licked the camera. He licked the middle of the camera. We need our A game here, buddy. Eight to tie, nine to win. Nine to win. The whole board, and that's a buzzer beater. They're not coming back from that. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Three minutes is all that stands between him and victory. One. You there got you this. Go. There it is. Oh, he unlocked it off the rip. That's a good one. He's still. St <laughs> He's, there's nothing in there, buddy. He already got that one. Get one of these. Come over here. Come on. Good boy. We'll help you out. I'm really rooting for you. Got a mermaid tail. Nice job. Just gonna keep keep getting after it. Got to this one. This one. There you go. Oop. He unlocked it and then relocked it, and now we're back to the first one we got. Carter, come on. You got this. Or take yeah, a page out of Coop's book. He got it. There it is. All right. Here we go. We've got about a minute left. Just gonna keep spinning that middle I'm thing. Oh, he's so close. There. Yes, he got it, he got it. Oh my goodness, this oh, is gonna be so close. The, the mermaid tail is open, the mermaid tail is open. He's gonna get this one, there it is. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's one There's one. One more piece in this, there. Coda, don't cover it. If you cover this piece, I'm gonna be so mad at you. There it is. 10 seconds left. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one. Oh, that's the end. Coda, pull it. What do, what do we have? We've got we've got one set here. Oh, he tied. They tied. Oh my goodness, Coda. Coop, come here. I can't believe it. This is crazy. We couldn't have scripted this any better. We tied. Woo! We tied. I'm blown away. So impressed. Legitimately. You know who's not impressed? Dead even tied. The, the cat. The ref is like. The ref. Just judging from her perch. So you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, th that was so cool. We're gonna have to do some more of these in the future. These are some of my favorite videos we do. So yeah. we'll see if we can get some even more difficult brain teasing games. I don't even know if they make them. We might have to make our own. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys next week. Peace out.